all rested and saved and re-equipped mostly with what we had before. However, I do want to go over the protect ring that we just spent a lot of time trying to get. It is good. It automatically sets up barrier and magic barrier on your party member. So it's worth it. I don't know why it took so long. I blame Crash. They are very nice to give you that free heal. Just one screen back of a relatively tough boss if you're not prepared for him with his elemental strengths. And we have made it outside onto apparently a hard ledge to walk across. We are no longer so cold that we need to show off our body temperature anymore. So we can just slowly climb up the rest of the cliff. Should be a straight climb from here. There it is, the very top. And what is on the other side of this cliff? One hell of a scene. What the hell is going on there? Let's go inside the giant crater here. An old crater. Something fell out of the sky and crashed down here, leaving a scar on the planet. It's amassed a vast amount of energy to heal itself. Sephiroth took that energy and is trying to use Meteor. Next time the wound won't be so small. This thing's already so big. Look at the size of this crater. Now here there are a couple enemies that I am looking to fight. Uh, this is not one of them. Uh, these are uh, grenades. Even though it doesn't really show that right now. Uh, we are going to be using boost jump on them. There's, there the, we can see that there, grenades. But Aqualung will take care of them. So we're not going to be using boost jump on them. And you want to use that as often as you can. And we leveled up Rama. Very nice. We're just going to continue leveling up the summons as, as we go until we master them from this point forward. And then probably never see him again. Like Chocomog. Who knows when we're going to see that again. Are we going to show... No, it's just going to be a damn grenade. As a result of that battle, I did master the Restore Materia. So I put the newly born Restore Materia in place of the mastered one on Fred. So he has only got Cure right now, but that should be fine, really. Back to Sephiroth. Now, unfortunately, I don't want to go on to the next screen yet because I'm looking for another new enemy. So I'm going to run around until I find him before I do head forward. And this is the enemy that I have been looking for. This is a Gigas, as you might imagine, because he is so tall. And I should be able to just attack to victory here. Uh, he has two items that I would like to get. However, one of them I'm not really going to go out of my way in order to get, so I don't need to steal from him. If you steal, he can't. He does have the Gigas armlet on him, but of course I won that already, so I don't really feel the need to go get more of those. Uh, what I'm going to do is try to defeat him normally. Down he goes. He's not too tough considering his size, really. Now he has a chance of dropping nothing. He also has a, a chance of dropping an item known as an earth mallet. So I'm going to keep on fighting him until he drops it. And I will be back. Remember that if you steal from an enemy, you don't get the drop. So if you're looking for the Earth Mallet, don't steal the Gigas Armlet from him. I will be back. Okay, I was finally able to get it. It is the Earth Mallet, like I said. It uses Quake 3 on all opponents. Now this is the only place that I know of that you can get it. So if you're looking for 99 of everything, you're gonna have to steal it 99 times. I am not going to be doing that, and we are going to continue forward. 
and get some more battles with either grenades or gigas, because that's all that's here. And as a result of that battle, I did get the level 2 limit break for Stefan. It is Death Gigas. He turns into Death Gigas. Very descriptive. Thank you. We're going to activate that right now because he doesn't have anything in his limit gauge anyway. And we're ready to move on. Now we are at the bottom of the crater. This looks quite strange. Fred, wait for me! Who's that? Oh, Cheska. Right. Took me a while to to her face. Please take me with you. You're going to have it out with Sephiroth, aren't you? Because of Sephiroth, I too have lost many things. So please take me along. Don't say no, okay? It can't be helped. And unfortunately, I have to break up the party that I just kind of set up, really. Uh, I'm still considering taking Tank and Spaz with us, but because of Limit Breaks alone, I'm going to be taking Crash with us because Crash does need the most work on his Limit Breaks, especially now that Stefan just got his first level 2 Limit Break. We're going to work with Crash some more, and I have already unequipped Stefan for the occasion. Lucky me. He still hangs out here, though. Don't be caught off guard. Sephiroth may be near. But I still need to equip Cheska, so I'll be back. Straight transfer of everything from Stefan over to Cheska, and we're ready to move on. Let's continue going forward, and hopefully we can find Sephiroth somewhere along the way here. Did he just jump off to his doom? Dude? You okay down there? I don't think he's coming back. But if we head over here, we can find a nice shiny Neo Bahamut. That, of course, is a new summon. Let's see. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. I'm not going to equip it anyway. Here it is, just for you to look at. I think it does the same 2, 2, 10, 10 as everybody else. No, it does a little bit different. It's double everything that Bahamut does. Neo Bahamut has a longer animation. I think this is the one that doesn't look so good, but it does look like an awesome attack. We will show that off at some point, but not right now. We'll have to switch out like Ifrit or something uh, along the way. Or Shiva? I think Shiva's the first one that we're gonna switch out and then we'll show off Neo Bahamut. But there is a save point here. I am going to take full advantage of that should I manage to stay on the platform. There we go. Let me rest and save. Actually, it looks like bringing Sheska into the party healed everybody in the party, so all I really have is Sheska's uh, MP that I'm missing. It's kind of weird. Okay, well, we'll take it and move on. So I did drop the save, though. That's... That's what? It's Shinra. The whole damn board, it looks like. Well, most of them. So, I finally found you. <laughs> ah, she laughs so damn much. Y you done, Scarlet? This is incredible. Whoa, she's quite revealing there. This is the promised land the president has been searching for. But I'll be the one who gets it. Sorry, old man. That land is no one's. The Turks are there too. It's where the reunion will take place. They will all gather here. I wonder if we'll see Sephiroth? Is he somewhere around here? I, I don't know. I just know there is a whole bunch of stuff that I need to go take care of right here. We need to inspect these bodies if they allow me to. We need to cross when the wind is calm or we'll get swept off. That's not true. Not at all. <laughs> Sephiroth. And we get a high potion off that guy. Whoa. And an ether off of that guy. Now I'm going to purposely run into the, uh, the wall when the wind's up here. Just to show you that you don't get swept off. And as a result of doing that, you get into a battle. It'll be the same enemy every time. So I just want to show this once. Sheska wants to show off a limit break so let's show that off let's just go for hits that way we actually get to see it we got beat rush of course followed by somersault and then water kick there's more than enough to defeat that guy it's a 
is that his name? It's Windwing? Yeah, Windwing. I've been actually written down here that he will fight a Windwing. So that is his name, in case you didn't get a chance to see it. So, wait for the wind to die down this time. There it goes, and now you can run across. It's not difficult at all to get the timing on that. They are very forgiving on that one. Looks like reunion is happening. More people are jumping off to their doom, though. There they go. That is not looking good for me. Not looking good at all. I don't know why it, it, it would be me, but it doesn't look like anything good is happening to these guys. We get a Kaiser Knuckle out of there. That is a weapon for Sheska. We haven't looked at her weapons for a while. She's got a Power Soul, a uh, Grand Glove. Uh, a lot of stuff we have seen before. Tiger Fang we saw. Motor Drive, that's not bad. Diamond Knuckle is pretty damn good. Work Glove is the no growth, no materia growth glove for her. Dragon Claw, that is also good. Kaiser Knuckle fills it out. Uh, right now, though, I think I'm going to stick with the Platinum Fist. Primarily because I do want the double growth. That's more important right now to me because I don't have that many materia left to try to level up. But I want to level them up more than anything else. We'll just keep going. And we'll get into more fights. We should have new enemies here because I don't think the Gigas show up here. Nor do the bombs, the grenades. Uh, we just have sculptures to fight. <laughs> They're not very good sculptures if you ask me. I don't remember these sculptures. Just purely as an art critic, I would say that these are quite bad. Uh, Sheska does need to use her limit more than she needs to kill things right now. Of course, it would be nice if she did kill things. She did actually get a counter there. I do have the counter attack on her because I just transferred all the things to find her. Uh, we're not getting the, uh, the cover working for us right now. Stop using your damn fire thing. He gets three of them in a row? What kind of crap is that? Sheska does not have very much health. I need to bring Sheska and Tank in. Maybe not for limit breaks, but just so they can catch up in terms of levels. Hey, more preemptive. That is good. That does not happen to me very often, the preemptive battles. But whatever, I'll take it. Let's head up here and watch as these guys just fade away. It is not looking good for us at all, is it? Nothing. Nothing working too well for us. Let's just continue on. Back to this thing, and I believe here I want to get hit as well. There we go. It's not going to be another one of the same enemies, is it? I think it's a new enemy this time. Could be the same thing, though. It is the same thing, unfortunately. 